Hey guys, Danny Johnson here, and today I want to explain what a piston is. So uh, basically what I have here is a piston and a connecting rod, and as a little more of a visual aid here, the piston and connecting rod connect to the crankshaft, and then this is all inside the block of your engine. Now we'll go over some of that uh, in another video, I'm sure. But uh, basically, the piston's job is to absorb the explosion that occurs when the air fuel mixture is ignited and uh, that's what pushes the piston down and it also then pushes down the connecting rod and so as it's riding on the crankshaft as it's being pushed down it turns the crankshaft and that's ultimately how your car moves. But uh, basically, I want to talk here about uh, the piston itself and what you have. So the uh, top of the piston is uh, this portion here. And as I mentioned, that's what it really absorbs the big uh, explosion each time that uh, the engine's fired. Then this top section right here, so this is the top uh, of the piston. Then you'll find uh, what you call a ring land. And the ring land is where these uh, rings sit in. So there's these little grooves cut all the way around the piston and uh, they're called ring lands. Then you have a first compression ring, a second compression ring, then under that you have an oil ring right here that's basically keeping the oil that's uh, down inside the engine splashing all around and, and moving it's going to keep that oil from passing up and going into the engine and burning. So if your car is burning a lot of oil, one of the possibilities are these rings are fried to the point that they, uh, they let oil, a lot of oil, pass by and, and then be burned in the engine. This portion right here is called the skirt of the piston. Okay, In here you have a little retaining ring and then right here you have the wrist pin. Okay, so that's how the connecting rod is connected to the piston. As you can see, it can move back and forth as the piston goes up and down. And uh, then you have the connecting rod that's attached to that port. 